Thank you so much for down. We watch your show. And uh, anyway, you, you look great out there. The sad part is that <sighs> Charles Barkley looked bad. <laughs> so, you're, you're looking great. And um, I thought the, I thought a cute thing. All right. Was, um, uh, I, I thought I would. <laughs> I thought I would show my guitars here, along with my new hobby of vlogging, I uh, play guitar, and I'm sitting on a big giant exercise ball right now that's not exactly uh, stable, um, so yeah, uh, yeah, I have a lot of guitars, um, the ones I have right here with me are... Not all of them. Well, I appreciate your comments. I have some that are in storage. We're not in storage. They're just in my closet. But uh, this is actually my base. Um, it's a Dean base. Uh, it's a piece of shit. <laughs> um, I'm not saying Dean bases are pieces of shit. I just don't like this one because it's... You know, it was a cheap base. Oh, um, I don't know. See, 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 see. Um, yeah, it was just, it was a cheap model. There's a lot of static to it. Uh, I just, you know, I, I got it just to learn bass about three, four years ago. And, uh, I learned bass, I guess. <laughs> I didn't, you know, I, I don't know everything about bass. I just know a lot, you know, I just like, I, I prefer playing guitar with songs, not bass, because bass is just... Just not, not included. Not as fun as guitar. So yeah. Um, now onto my guitars. Where can I put this thing at? That's not a comment on whether I thought it was good or not. All right. Uh, okay. These are my. I don't know if I can hold them up at the same time or not. I don't know if you can see those or not. <laughs> these are actually my two favorite guitars. And why is there a Christmas ball on the end of my guitar? Look at that. I don't know why that's on there, but... Right? Um, but yeah, these are uh, Epiphone SG... Uh, SGs. They're not Gibsons, so... Because I can't afford Gibson guitars because they're expensive as hell. Um... But yeah, uh, this one was made in uh, Indonesia, and this one was made in China, I think. Made in China, yep. And the only real difference between these two guitars is this one. This one weighs about two pounds more than this one, which I really can't figure out why. And Or, you know, obviously the wood is different. Uh, or why they actually made different woods on them. I guess it's because they're made in different countries, but... But yeah, I mean, this guitar is deep, has a deeper sound to it because heavier guitars just have deeper sounds. It has, but yeah, I prefer this guitar over that one on most of my playing. I, mean, I think that my red one's better for lead than it is for anything else because it has that more light, tangy sound to it. And this one has that more deep throat sound. But yeah, these are my my two favorite. Uh, and then I have my uh, my Spanish. Your gold investments could classical guitar here. It's kind of out of tune right now. It's way out of tune. Yeah, I, I love this guitar. I just, I just, I just like the nylon strings to it. Just, it's a nice guitar. <laughs> it, it wasn't really expensive. I can't remember who makes it. Gold rocketed to Lucero is a manufacturer. I got it off of uh, musiciansfriend.com, which isn't one of my favorite companies anymore because they take so freaking long. Oh, shit. Actually, I was going to get a uh, an Ibanez guitar over in over a 30% but it was on back order for like a month, and I got pissed off, and then I just canceled that order, and I got this one, I got the acoustic one, and then I got this one, or no, this one's my oldest acoustic, it's a, uh, yeah, it's a tank man, it's a, it's a nice guitar, it sounds better with the, uh, what the hell do I just do, it, uh, it sounds better with an amp than it does just acoustic, because it has a small body on it. Um, and then... <laughs> man, I don't know if I'm going to show 
Oh, then I have my uh, mandolin here and my ukulele, which I think a mandolin was a mistake. I really don't understand it. And this isn't your traditional ukulele. It's a tw it's an eight string ukulele. I like it a lot. It was also made in China. Um, it, it's a uh, Lanaka ukulele. Yeah, this is, I, I like this a lot. And then, <laughs> um, this is my, my mandolin, which I really don't like at all. It's cheap. It's made out of placard board, which is you, know, you don't want instruments made out of because the, the sounds are, are shit. Uh, if, if you're going to buy a ukulele, you better buy a good, uh, like, a mahogany wood, a, a good wood. Because if you don't buy a good wood, it's going to sound like shit. And, uh, yeah, I mean, this wood has expanded a little bit because of the humidity, but I mean, it's not that humid here in Texas, or it can't get in the summertime. But yeah, it's just, it's just a piece of shit. Um, and I don't, I don't like to call my instruments pieces of shit, but, and then over here... This is my amps. God damn, this is a six-minute video. Um, this is one of my effects pedals. That's my pink carpet. It's not my choice. It's, I rent this house. Um, <laughs> this is like a, a hundred-thing multi-effects pedal that's, that actually still works. Except I can't use my foot anymore. I just push these buttons on it. Um, somewhere I got my wall pedal over here. I don't know if it's over here. There it is right there. And there's my... Uh, Metal Zone effects pedal. Uh, these are all, I got a little tiny amp there. And this is this is my pride and joy. I've had this for like God, 17 years. Uh, and this is my bass amp. That's a piece of shit. I actually got this with my bass amp with my bass. But yeah, it's a piece of crap. And uh, I've got a, a, sli a lap steel slide guitar also. So yeah. These are my instruments.